Le Président, veuillez vous asseoir. L'audience est ouverte. We would like to hand over to counsel for Mr. to continue Et la parole est à la défense de Nunchia. Maître, vous pouvez poursuivre votre présentation ainsi que vos observations concernant les documents clés présentés par l'accusation et les co-avocats principaux des, des parties civiles. Thank you, Mr. President. Good afternoon, Maître Coquet, merci, Good afternoon, Monsieur le Président. Bonjour, Mesdames et Messieurs les juges. I will continue. With my comments on the probative value of the documents presented in respect of the targeting of the Bono officials and military, concerning the politics in matter of and I had arrived before the lunch break at the revolutionary flag from August 90. 77, document number E3-193. The prosecution claimed during uh, its presentation that this document contains an instruction to execute law no soldiers in positions of authority in um, cooperatives. First, Mr. President, we would like to ask the Chamber to notice that this particular document is dated two and a half years after the events at Tour Portrait. So, in our view, it is entirely irrelevant to state policy as it existed in April 1975. The substance of the document, in any case, contains only vague um, ideology. Sur le fond, ce document it has no instruction or order to cause harm to anyone. Now, the co-prosecutors may have succeeded in giving the chamber a different impression uh, during uh, their presentations, but they did that only through uh, duplicity. Et, uh, ils y By, sont as it were, stringing together into one uh, coherent coherent paragraph, three unrelated excerpts from three different pages. pages. They took one in passing reference to Long Nol soldiers out of context. context. They placed it next to a second out of context instruction four pages later to quote, smash the enemy. And then they invited the chamber to conclude that cadres were being instructed to smash Lone Null soldiers. A closer review of the document shows something much more benign. At ERN English 00399-234, Khmer 00629-6324, and French 00611839-240, the reference to Lone Old Soldier um, is merely an example of the non-peasant class in positions of authority in certain uh, cooperatives. To them, the reference is made. The instruction to smash on page 17 was not an instruction to kill people, but to eliminate ideology. And a fuller quote from that section of uh, the document reveals that, and I quote again, what longer uh, citation, who holds the power in each cooperative. Generally speaking, in the entire West Zone, in a large part, we already control the cooperatives and state power, meaning it is already in the hands of the party's worker peasants. It is still in the hands of various other classes. And if it is in the hands of other classes, have those classes come over to the site of the revolution? No, they oppose the revolution. 
It is only a matter à la of whether they oppose the revolution a little or a la lot. Question is simplement de savoir whether they anto antagonistically ou oppose ou à la or do not yet an antagonistically oppose. Si After we make this assessment, we have to prepare to lead the cooperatives. Après avoir prepare what cette forces? Évaluation. Nous prepare the poor peasants and the lower middle class peasants to control the cooperatives, to attack and smash the state power of other classes who stole control from, uh, who stole control from of our cooperatives and give it back to the poor peasants and the lower middle class peasants down below. Now we have been able to screen and fight in the zone, able to fight in the sectors, Nous avons, uh, pu, able uh, to fight in the districts. Et, uh, but we have not been able to fight, we have not yet been able to fight in the cooperatives. Et dans les districts, mais nous it is imperative to prepare forces to attack, attack and smash the enemy de and the no good elements embedded inside attaquer, and controlling the cooperatives. Les à End of quote. We would like to, to ask the Chamber to recognize um, two things about this larger quote. Si One is that the so-called other classes in control of the cooperatives do not necessarily, les, uh, I quote, antagonistically oppose the revolution. Ne, uh, pas and the second is the instruction to, quote, smash the state power of other classes and then give that power, quote, back to the poor peasants and the lower middle class peasants down below. Now, no policy to execute former soldiers could possibly be inferred from this document. Il est impossible de conclure qu'une politique visant à exécuter des soldats existe. Monsieur le Président, les quatre derniers documents présentés par la prosecution all purport to be military communications from either the north or north northwest zones and addressed to either Committee 870, Ankar, or Brother Paul. The four documents are similar. They all report that enemies have been recently identified and state that some of them are uh, former Lono soldiers. One document states that they were arrested and two do not say what action, if any, was taken. The last telegram states that the soldiers were purged. As we have uh, seen, that, that term can have uh, different meanings. So these final four documents are literally the only four documents, only four key documents presented by the co-prosecutors, which suggest that anyone in the party center was even aware uh, uh, that any action of any kind was taken against former Khmer Republic officials beyond, beyond the seven super traitors. None of these documents say that the soldiers were killed. None of the documents describe any action Aucun taken by the party center. And all of the documents are dated long after the events at to portray took place. So they are not in any way probative of a policy to execute all Khmer Republic soldiers and officials as of. Um, April 1975. Mr. President, Your Honours, that concludes our discussion of the prosecution's statements, the prosecution's documents. We will now turn to the final segment of our response with regard to this alleged policy.
Um, we will present uh, documents, uh, certain witness statements, tendered into evidence by uh, the co-prosecutors. Now, those statements will establish two things. First, the witnesses who are best placed to know about the intentions of the party center and the conduct of troops and cadres on the ground consistently state, testify, that law and soldiers and officials were unharmed. Second, the evidence which the prosecution, prosecution contends um, establish a pattern of executions is systematically unreliable, especially in the light of the direct evidence which contradicts it. Uh, Mr. President, with your leave, um, the first document we would like to present is an excerpt uh, from a video. Um, the video is uh, one day at Poultry. You have seen um, portions from that video uh, earlier. Uh, the document uh, number is E1861R. The, um, the relevant passage in that video is from um, the timer at 21 minutes up until 22 minutes and 3 seconds. And in it, um, Nguyen states his position about uh, whether a policy to execute former Lono soldiers existed. So with your leave, uh, Mr. President, I would like to, to show uh, the chamber this uh, minute from the two portraits. The President, uh, Mr. Co-Prosecutor, you may now proceed. Uh, thank you, Mr. President. Um, this, notwithstanding that this video was not on the list of uh, uh, presentation documents that we were provided with. We have, we have no objection to it. I assume, however, that Council will be playing the full excerpt uh, given his repeated uh, ad hominem attacks on the prosecution today. Um, I would hope uh, that he is playing the full excerpt of what Nunche has said on this tape, including the part where he admits uh, to the execution of the top officials of the law and all regime. But assuming that Council is playing the full uh, excerpt of this video, de, uh, uh, we have no objection, notwithstanding it not having been listed. À partir du moment où uh, tout l'extrait est montré, nous ne nous y opposons pas, malgré le fait que um, la vidéo ne figure pas sur la liste de documents. We were, I was intending to particularly show um, the passage in which he says um, that there was no such policy. I do agree with the prosecution that um, the video Je suis goes a little further, and I have no problem in showing that as well. So that would be then, Mr. President, an instruction to uh, the AV unit to show, I think, 20 or 30 seconds more than than, than now uh, to you uh, anticipate. The Indeed, Council, you may proceed. I um, requested uh, to have uh, this portion of the video footage uh, be put up on the screen, and I uh, the co prosecutor already requested that the showing of the video should be longer 
than what uh, has been requested. Donc, the, the chamber also agrees de la durée uh, that par, uh, la défense, this la extra portion should also be put up on donc display. Que la suite de cet extrait doit également être this projeté. means uh, the video length would be now 30 or 40 seconds longer. Now, if we booth is advised uh, to put up this document on the screen. De projeter ce document. ອັນນີ້ສົມມາປະຈຽອມຈຳນົດໃນຫນຸ່ມຕິດຕຶງເລີຍ <coughs> ពីបីនាក់ខាងលើតើមានអ្នកណាខ្លះឬយ៉ាងម៉េចមកតោះថាពេលក្រោយតែរំដោះមកវាមានការដែលយកទាហានទៅសម្រាប់អីចឹងប
perhaps thirty to forty extra seconds. seconds de plus. ពីនោះពូសាតអាតបងបៃលិនបន្ទីមានជាតើបញ្ហានេះអំមានបានជ្រាបទេពីនោះបាទពេលនោះខ្ញុំមិនដឹងទៅក្នុងការដោះស្រ
Nuanchia's relationship with TCW223 dates to before the Geneva Conference, some 60 years ago. The President, the President uh, Mr. Co-Prosecutor, you may now proceed. Monsieur le Co-Procureur, vous avez la parole. Uh, Mr. President, this is another document I didn't see on the list, and if I just heard right, um, I, it sounded to the prosecution like counsel is reading from one of his own filings. Uh, again, reading from your own filings is not presenting documentary evidence, so we would object to, uh, to counsel's doing that if, if indeed I understood correctly as to what this document is. Ce pas habituel. Savoir de quoi il um, of course, Mr. President, we, we um, Bien sûr, le try to figure out um, the exact um, parameters of this proceedings. Um, we are allowed to present our own key documents. Nous I'm not quite sure where comprendre les um, the limits are between nous avons le droit de possible des evidence or Alors, où sont les limites according from entre, your own work, uh, so to speak. Des, uh, so, um, et, uh, cité son unless, of course, there's a Je ruling from your side that we are allowed to quote from um, de la chambre, the motions, then we would like la to, chambre, nous to cite à from this document uh, and, uh, and consider it to be a key document. Requête, donc je désire citer ce document comme étant un document clé. The president, objection by the, defend, uh, by the co prosecutor against uh, the exercise of rights uh, by the defense team on observing on the document presentation is appropriate. Therefore, the defense team is directed uh, not to. Uh, quote uh, portion of uh, your documents uh, to present. The chamber has already advised uh, you already that uh, you are here to respond to the various uh, key documents presented by co-prosecutors and lead co-lawyers uh, for the civil party uh, presented from the 24th uh, to the 27th of June. And the defense team has also made Et it clear uh, to the chamber that uh, you do not have any uh, proposed key documents to present, but you want to reserve your right to respond uh, to the various uh, key documents submitted by other parties, and you may also raise an objection against those documents. Thank you, Mr. President. Uh, we will move on. Uh, the next document I would Maître like Merci. to Je present, and I'm not quite sure if I'm now um, prohibited of Je ne sais pas from presenting si other documents. Just, um, de présenter it is not from our own work. It is always pas nice to be quoting, but Look, I de notre propre travail. The president. Est toujours agréable de citer. You may make uh, additional observations on the key documents presented by other parties, but you are not allowed uh, to uh, extract any portion of your documents to make a presentation uh, now, because you are supposed uh, to comment or uh, make any observation on the key documents uh, presented by co-prosecutors and lead co-lawyers for the civil parties. Parties. Uh, from the 24th uh, to the 27th of uh, June 2013. Du 24 au 27 juin 2013. Um, I understand, Mr. President. La défense, we we je bien. Um, have understood it in such a way that 
selon notre compréhension, même si initialement nous n'avions pas dit que nous allions le faire, nous pensions que nous serions autorisés à présenter nos propres documents clés. Ceci est apparu documents Si vous ne voulez pas que nous citions des documents que nous considérons comme des documents clés, mais laissez-moi voir rapidement ce qu'il en est du reste de ce que je voulais dire concernant la politique. Le président, uh, uh, Sil la parole est à la juge Cartwright. Merci, Monsieur le Président. Je suis sûr que vous comprenez, M. Coffey. La Chambre et la Cour de Chambre est que vous ne pouvez pas citer en tant que document clé vos propres écritures, vos propres demandes. Mais, bien sûr, la Chambre va vous accueillir et vous accueillir vos propres demandes. Mais, bien entendu, la Chambre va vous accueillir et vous accueillir vos propres demandes. Mais, bien entendu, la Chambre va vous accueillir et vous accueillir vos propres demandes. Mais, bien entendu, la Chambre va vous accueillir et vous accueillir vos propres demandes. Mais, bien entendu, la Chambre va vous accueillir et vous accueillir vos propres demandes. Mais, bien entendu, la Chambre va vous accueillir et vous accueillir vos propres demandes. Mais, bien entendu, la Chambre va vous accueillir et vous accueillir vos propres demandes. Mais, bien entendu, la Chambre va vous accueillir et vous accueillir vos propres demandes. Mais, bien entendu, la Chambre va vous accueillir et vous accueillir vos propres demandes. Mais, bien entendu, la Chambre va vous accueillir et vous accueillir vos propres demandes. Mais, bien entendu, la Chambre va vous accueillir et vous accueillir vos propres demandes. Mais, bien entendu, la Chambre va vous accueillir et vous accueillir vos propres demandes. Mais, bien entendu, la Chambre va vous accueillir et vous accueillir vos propres demandes. Mais, bien entendu, la Chambre va vous accueillir et vous accueillir vos propres demandes. Mais, bien entendu, la Chambre va vous accueillir et vous accueillir vos propres demandes. Mais, bien entendu, la Chambre va vous accueillir et vous accueillir vos propres demandes. Mais, bien entendu, la Chambre va vous accueillir et vous accueillir vos propres demandes. Mais, bien entendu, la Chambre va vous accueillir et vous accueillir vos propres demandes. Mais, bien entendu, la Chambre va vous accueillir et vous accueillir vos propres demandes. Mais, bien entendu, la Chambre va vous accueillir et vous accueillir vos propres demandes. Mais, bien entendu, la Chambre va vous accueillir et vous accueillir vos propres demandes. Mais, bien entendu, la Chambre va vous accueillir et vous accueillir vos propres demandes. Mais, bien entendu, la Chambre va vous accueillir et vous accueillir vos propres demandes. Mais, bien entendu, la Chambre va vous accueillir et vous accueillir vos propres demandes. Mais, bien entendu, la Chambre va vous accueillir et vous accueillir vos propres demandes. Mais, bien entendu, la Chambre va vous accueillir et vous accueillir vos propres demandes. Mais, bien entendu, la Chambre va vous accueillir et vous accueillir vos propres demandes. Mais, bien entendu, la Chambre va vous accueillir et vous accueillir vos propres demandes. Mais, bien entendu, la Chambre va vous accueillir et vous accueillir vos propres demandes. Mais, bien entendu, It's from an OCIJ statement of a witness who has appeared before this chamber. That witness is Rochun Tong. Ah yes, 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 Rochun Tong. And the Khmer version zero zero two zero four zero six nine. I apologize, Judge Laverne, because I don't see why I don't have a French accent. Excusez-moi, Judge Laverne. Je ne sais pas pourquoi, mais je ne vois pas de RN français. Je communiquerai ça plus tard. The question put to the witness, Mr. President, is whether there were orders to seek out lone soldiers. And the answer of people is as follows. Let's see what the answer is. The answer of people is as follows. Let's see what the answer is. The answer of people is as follows. Let's see what the answer is. The answer of people is as follows. Let's see what the answer is. The answer of people is as follows. Let's see what the answer is. Non, parce qu'ils avaient déjà agité des drapeaux blancs. Des instructions claires avaient été données comme quoi il ne fallait pas les toucher. Pendant la guerre sur le champ de bataille, c'était différent. À présent qu'ils s'étaient rendus, nous ne devions pas les toucher, simplement les accueillir. Et nous souhaitions la bienvenue et répondre à leurs questions. Il a dit que c'était des Cambodgiens comme nous. Ne les touchez pas du tout. Voilà les mots de Pol Pot. Un commentaire supplémentaire. Quand Philip Short est venu déposer, il a dit qu'il existait une politique consistant à exécuter les soldats de l'OMNOL en affirmant que c'était, je cite, un fait. Nous l'avons interrogé abondamment. Il n'a pu citer qu'une source lui ayant dit directement avoir été au courant personnellement de l'exécution de soldats de l'OMN. C'est cette source-là. Quelle était cette source C'était justement Pipun. There are several other witnesses, Mr. President. I could quote, but I will settle on just one more. And I'm quoting this one witness just to give the chamber one example of soldiers who were fighting on the ground and who say similar things about the orders they received. This is a transcript. It 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 is a transc
d'audience. J'espère que je serai autorisé à présenter ce document daté du 25 octobre 2012. Je vois que l'accusation se lève. Je passe à autre chose, Monsieur le Président. Um, What I would like to do now, uh, Mr. President, is to talk about the statements that the co-prosecutors presented. The co-prosecutors read from three statements in court. Ont lu des de trois When they finished, they said, Ensuite, and I quote, a dit, je cite, "There are many witness statements I could read je from. Citer des de Those have been identified témoins. in our filing Cela of relevant witness statements to this policy." Dans nos les déclarations de témoins pertinentes par rapport à cette politique. Je pointe ça à la Chambre parce que c'est bien clair pour nous pour un moment que c'est parce que c'est un certain temps que the direct evidence nous sommes au cœur des arguments de l'accusation. Il n'y a pas de preuve directe de l'existence so d'une politique. Donc il semble qu'ils sont maintenant en train de dans des déclarations suggesting that submerger la chambre de déclaration laissant entendre qu'il y a eu des exécutions to manufacture an impression that this practice was so widespread that it must have happened pursuant to a policy répandu qu'elle a dû être le fruit d'une politique testified that that was essentially his argument he was positive that the policy existed l'argument de philippe chaud il était sûr que la politique existait il a dit que c'était un fait quand on l'a interrogé Il a dit que la seule preuve, c'était que cela s'était produit partout. Right now to the je souligne ceci maintenant pour expliquer les remarques que je vais faire à présent. Pour répondre aux arguments de Philippe Schroff, je vais répondre aux arguments de Philippe Schroff. 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 Je vais répondre aux ar
Ils parlent de plusieurs Some choses. Certains say say témoins disent avoir Khmer vu Republic des soldats ou fonctionnaires de la République Khmer être groups. séparés de But groupes plus vastes. Mais ces gens people. disent ne pas savoir ce qui est arrivé aux intéressés. We have already said today why Comme we think nous avons déjà dit pourquoi nous pensons que ce type de preuve n'est pas fiable et est dénué de toute valeur probante. Other witnesses say that they saw dead bodies of soldiers on the side of the road in or around de la Phnom Penh, Phnom Penh shortly after 17 April 1975. Now, because the soldiers of that army had just been defeated in a war, the fact that dead bodies guerre, were on the ground et donc is probably la présence of literally nothing. De cadavres also, that terre, evidence ne prouve littéralement rien. Ces éléments de preuve devraient donc aussi être Numerous statements of these hundred statements, including the majority of the victim complaints, merely state the bare fact that friends or relatives who were part of the law and regime were killed. In most cases, there is no reason at all to believe that those people were killed because they were law and soldiers. Because they were law and soldiers. La plupart du temps, il n'est pas dit qu'il y ait des raisons de croire que ces gens ont été tués au motif de ce Les trois déclarations décrites par l'accusation est le flanc D25-28 concerne le crâne concernant la prison de Krang Tachan associée à la coopérative de Trump. Le témoin dit, je cite, when they arrived there, they had them make biographies. Ils ont fait and anyone whose biography said they had been a soldier would disappear. Avoir été soldat, but the statement, however, shows toutefois, at English ERN 0023475 that the witness had no role at le Krang témoin a joué aucun prison. Rôle à la prison de Krang Tachan. He went there once to inspect a quote disturbance because someone had already had allegedly been raped. Un incident he could not have any personal knowledge about what happened at the prison. Présumé. Cette personne n'aurait pas pu savoir personnellement ce qui s'est passé à la prison. The witness in the second statement, D232-44, told the investigating judges Ici, only that, le témoin as dit far as I know, ceci, evacuees were taken for execution. Que je sache, he then said that those who indicated that they were law and soldiers Ensuite, when they first arrived, quote, later on il a dit que ceux qui affirmaient avoir été he also suggested that many other people were killed. à leur arrivée ont disparu par la suite. No il a laissé entendre que beaucoup d'autres gens ont été tués, mais il n'a offert quote, aucune unquote, information de première main du sort de ces personnes après leur disparition. Je passe à la troisième déclaration, D125-91, ici le témoin dit, je cite, « Je les ai vus » conduire à pied des centaines de personnes qui devaient claim, être tuées. Cependant, le témoin ne dit pas avoir no vu ces gens se faire tuer. Il n'a pas non plus indiqué comment il savait que ces gens avaient été tués. Apparemment, les enquêteurs n'ont pas pris la peine de lui poser la question. Mr. President, the Chamber to recall that these are the three statements se souvienne the prosecution chose, que ces trois déclarations to best exemplify their evidence that former soldiers and officials of the Khmer Republic were systematically executed. And that kind of evidence has consistently fallen apart during the cross-examination, as we have seen last week during the examinations of Peck Chim and Lev Lam. I will not discuss um, the evidence given by those two witnesses, you were all there de present, so you remember, I'm sure. Présent, vous, vous en souvenez, but it is obvious that once cross-examined, no witness uh, 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 stands at the end of the cross-examination. Qu'un témoignage ne tient debout. The President, Council, please uh, hold on. Le Mr. Prosecutor, you may proceed. Le Président, attendre. La parole est à l'accusation. Uh, thank you, Mr. President. I wanted to give Council a chance to uh, do this presentation, and we certainly have no object objection to him 
nous n'avons pas d'objection des commentaires sur la valeur de la déclaration. Par contre, his attempt Je right now to make submissions and arguments about the credibility of witnesses who have testified in this trial. And I would also object um, to his prior attempt to testify himself about the content of the other statements, uh, his assertion that none of these statements evidence executions of law and soldiers is simply incorrect. Um, que personne n'a dit qu'il y avait eu des exécutions uh, de soldats de l'ONOL, c'est faux, ce n'est pas uh, le moment de présenter des réquisitoires et plaidoiries, mais l'avocat n'est pas un témoin, il peut présenter les dépositions de témoins, il peut faire des commentaires sur les déclarations que nous avons présentées, mais l'avocat n'est pas là pour faire son propre résumé de ses arguments sur les déclarations de témoins the testimony of, of the witnesses that he's referring to right now. Mr. President, I will move on. La I défense. have um, um, one suite. or two more things to say uh, about uh, the policy of targeting former and all officials and soldiers, and then uh, I will be finishing uh, my submissions or my reactions to the uh, key documents. Um, and my last remark, uh, is the following, Mr. President, Your Honours. Une dernière chose. It would seem that um, from a statement uh, that you, Mr. President, made in passing during the trial management meeting Lors on de la June 30, de en état, that the Chamber is likely on the verge juin, uh, of omitting every one of these uh, statements that I just mentioned. That is true. Our position remains that that decision would be based Quelque on chose serious que misreading of the applicable law. It would also be a violation of new right to a fair trial. Du droit de but if un the statements équitable. are to be admitted, Mais it is essential that the Chamber bear in mind its decision of 20 June 2012. Doit sa décision that decision de is at E96-7. And in it, the Chamber held that if statements La Chambre are admitted dit, without cross-examination, si it would be afforded little or no probative value. Peu ou pas de valeur probante and for all of the reasons I have just discussed today, pour toutes these les statements we have been discussing are especially unreliable and have no probative value whatsoever. Ne sont pas fiables, and so that holding aucune valeur uh, probante. needs to be taken seriously, Mr. President. Even if we were to disregard Même all si of the problems Ignorer uh, with the reliability, tous les problèmes the de fiabilité, de valeur of these probante and de ces déclarations, face value, les accepter, they would still fail to establish tout, that the CPK tout cela ne permettrait pas d'établir que le PCK avait une politique d'exécution des anciens soldats et fonctionnaires de la République mère. That is because almost all of that evidence in those statements of any kind concerns events in either the northwest or the southwest zone. De la zone et if CPK policy existed, the evidence would show executions across the country. Avait une politique du PCK, Yet, il y aurait des preuves d'exécution dans tout le pays. The witness statements, the Or, evidence, the documents de of executions in five of the seven zones of Democratic Kampuchea is virtually non-existent. Aucune preuve dans Obviously, ça, Mr. President, you are unfortunately, we cannot démocratique. make this showing uh, systematically here today. Faire une présentation but we invite the Chamber Nous to observe that all three witnesses, the co-prosecutors, sought at the June 13 trial management meeting were from either the southwest or northwest zone. Du 13 juin, all three witness statements la the co-prosecutors presented on June 26 were from the southwest or Les northwest zone. And the closing order itself concedes at paragraph 209 juin that de la officials were targeted, nord quote, in particular in the northwest and southwest zone. Dans de clôture, il est écrit, and our analysis, and I, je cite this is my last words, uh, Mr. President, shows that this bias permits all of the evidence nord -ouest et sud -ouest. and we'll make that showing with greater specific specificity in our closing briefs. Exposer cela plus en détail dans notre um, mémoire de clôture. That is rounding up, Mr. President, my um, submissions, my voilà. our reactions to the presentation voilà of key documents 
à la présentation uh, des documents clés uh, policy, concernant la politique consistant à prendre pour cible les ennemis. Um, like um, J'aimerais à présent réagir à la présentation des documents de l'accusation et des partis civils sur le mariage forcé. To begin, I would like uh, to refer the chamber to the closing order. D'abord, je renvoie la chambre à l'ordonnance de As the chamber is aware, the title of this policy is Cette in the closing order is the regulation of marriage. La dite ordonnance porte le titre réglementation du mariage. But the underlying facts of the legis are much more precise. Les faits sous-jacents sont bien plus précis. Paragraph 216 states, de l'ordonnance de clôture, the CPK forced dit, couples to marry, je cite, as it took control progressively over parts of Cambodian territory before 1975, and, and continued to do so until at least 6 January 1979. Paragraph 218 states, and I quote, there is evidence that the CPK forced people to marry as early as 1974. End of quote. And other allegations in the closing order are similar. Il y a des allegations similaires dans l'ordonnance de clôture. Now the question, Mr. President, in this document presentation hearing is therefore whether the Communist Party of Cambodia... La question ici est donc de savoir si le PCK a adopté une politique consistant à forcer des gens à se marier. And like, uh, the closing order, Comme l'ordonnance de clôture, l'accusation a allégué que des couples because that policy furthered the goals of the revolution. étaient forcés à se marier parce qu'une telle politique allait dans le sens des objectifs de la révolution. Now we would like the chamber to ask que la Chambre a se pose question. une question simple. If forced marriage si le mariage was a core forcé of the était un aspect central de la révolution, for the purpose of furthering objectives that the revolution deemed important, afin d'atteindre les objectifs importants de la révolution, ne pourrait-on pas s'attendre à ce the party. que le parti ait the question is, was the Communist Party of Kampuchea shy politique. about the goals it thought were que important? Le PCK Did it not explicitly say, for instance, that people should leave the city and li live in the cooperatives in the countryside? Était réticent à annoncer les objectifs importants? Yet, there is only one consistency in the documents presented by the Explicitement, par exemple, que la population devait quitter la ville et vivre en coopérative. Ces documents de l'accusation concordent sur un seul point. Ils ne disent rien sur les mariages forcés. Et dans bien des cas, ils ne disent rien sur le mariage tout court. L'accusation demande à la Chambre de la suivre dans sa logique tortueuse. L'accusation veut que la Chambre décide comme suit. Premièrement, le PCK like avait des objectifs, comme celui d'accroître la population, population that might be ce qui pourrait to vaguement être lié à une politique de mariage forcée. And two, Et deuxièmement, des mariages forcés se seraient produits. Therefore, the prosecution wants this chamber to hold. Conséquent, l'accusation veut que la Chambre considère que le mariage CPK. forcé a dû procéder d'une politique du PCK. Now, obviously, that would be inadequate, Ceci even if forced marriage were within the scope of this trial. Même si le mariage forcé relevait de but la it is not within the scope of this Or, trial, ce pas le cas. which means that all the supposed evidence that forced marriages de mariage took place is at this stage inadmissible. À ce stade. It also means Cela that what the co-prosecutors co are left with is vague political ne theory. Se what we would like to do, Your Honours, is to go through the documents that were presented in relation to this alleged policy and to show the Chamber that our characterization of the, uh, the, the key documents as evidence is accurate. Ces documents clés est exact. The prosecution began its presentation on forced marriage with a set of documents that they believe un groupe de documents 
concerne l'un des objectifs ultimes du régime, population growth. à savoir la croissance démographique. These reports and interviews, Parmi ces uh, rapports et interviews, il y a flag, le numéro de l'étendard révolutionnaire, uh, document E3-25, a speech by Yang Sari, E3-15-186, uh, um, and an interview with Nguyen Chia, et un entretien document avec Nguyen Chia, document E3-686. These documents ces documents are believed to describe the CPK's plan to increase le the Cambodian population to 15 or 20 million people la in the years following the liberation. I, if we, if we understand correctly in, in the prosecution's si mind, in order to achieve this population growth, de the CPK insisted in forced marriages of Cambodian citizens. Le PCK a insisté pour que les Now, even assuming for argument's sake that a plan si de façon to increase population existed, on acceptait l'existence d'un plan d'accroissement démographique. When you read those documents, there is no mention of forced marriage in any que dans aucun of these cas, documents. Il fait mention de mariage forcé. Indeed, the documents propose an propose entirely different quelque chose de and frankly much more logical way of increasing de bien the population. Logique pour accroître la population, Namely, à savoir the living standard and augmenter of le niveau de Cambodians vie et la santé des Cambodgiens ordinaires dans tout le pays. Take for instance document par exemple, E3 slash 25, that is an issue of revolutionary flag from December 1976 till January 1977. The prosecution quoted from that document, ce document the following passage. That was at ERN 00491435. We need from 15 to 20 million people to meet the needs of our land. For our population to constantly increase, the livelihood of the people must rise and they must be in good health. So then this means quickly increasing production. Document number E3-1586, the speech by Ying Sari, which the prosecution claims is particularly relevant, says uh, at ERN 0079815, something similar. We are endeavoring very rapidly to improve the living conditions and health of our people because we need a population of 15 and, million, 15 and 20 million in 10 years' time de 15 à 20 millions quote. de personnes d'ici à 10 ans. Fin de citation. So, so these documents have no probative value whatsoever. Ces they are all irrelevant. Aucune valeur probante. Ils sont they suggest de only the existence of a Ils general political goal. Ils vont seulement dans le sens d'un objectif politique no logical général. There is no logical or empirical reason why that goal aucune raison would be served logique by forcing people logique ou empirique to marry each other. que cet objectif soit atteint and the documents themselves explicitly les documents give a different and much more comprehensible method of achieving that goal. Une façon so these documents et presented by the prosecution objective. should all Ces be disregarded. De accusation donc tous être the prosecution then moved on to documents that purportedly detail the CPK concept of marriage and family. The prosecution submitted during the, the documents hearing that the regime believed that the traditional concept of family was superseded by the revolutionary family and that caring for an individual's family above the socialist movement was a betrayal. Once again, the prosecution is trying to turn water into wine. In other words, to find in the vaguest political theory a specific policy to force people to enter into marriages. 
One issue of revolutionary youth from October 1976 is typical of the documents uh, presented by the prosecution. The document number is E3-10, and the quote is from ERN 00450539. President, I apologize. You must have observed that I'm only quoting the English uh, ERN numbers. Um, we will present them to you at a later stage. But uh, the document number, E3-10, uh, in it, it states as follows, and I quote, private property, other manifestations, private ownerships, ownership in organization by one's personal sentiments, by one's family, by one's clique, and notwithstanding the political ideology and the organizational line of the party is wrong. For example, anyone who thinks a lot about family interests, interest always deceives the revolution and lives separately, seeking family happiness, not seeking happiness inside the party. End of quote. Another document presented by the prosecution, E3-750, is also an issue of um, revolutionary youth from November 1975. And at ERN 00522461, the article states as follows, and I quote, in our revolutionary rank, our revolutionary male and female combatants and cadres sacrifice the private possessions such as housing, petty farm, garden, family, parents, relatives, children and other properties in order to serve the party revolution and the people. As we hope is surely apparent, Mr. President, there is no mention of forced marriage in any of these documents. So it is our submission that these documents have no probative value and are irrelevant. Another document cited by the prosecution is uh, again an issue of revolutionary youth. Document E3-766. And again, I will quote this time from ERN 00524181. The magazine relays, uh, and the, the magazine relays a per, um, parable, parable, I'm not quite sure how to pronounce it, about a 15-year-old boy. And it states, and I quote, uh, I have no parents or siblings. I am the, the child of the Communist Party of Kampuchi. My parents and my siblings were killed and smashed by the Yuan enemy during the invasion of 1976. The villagers, my house, my rice paddies were destroyed and plundered by the Yuan enemy and taken back to their country. Now I am living in a new family. My parents are none other than the Communist Party of Kamuchia, and I will now strive to do my best. End of quote. First of all, Mr. President, yet again, this document says nothing about forced marriage. In fact, it says nothing of marriage at all. So we submit it can be disregarded for that reason alone. It has no probative value. But we will add that even the message that the prosecution wants to draw uh, from it is a poor interpretation of the document itself. We suppose that the prosecution thinks this document shows that the CPK was encouraging people to think of the party as their only family. But we submit that the only reasonable inf inference to make from this story is that it represents the CPK telling its citizens that it will protect them in their time of need. Now, if it were intended as propaganda in favor of the eradication of the family, 
même si le message était décidé. Il would the fact that the boy has no parents. The boy wouldn't want pour to have parents. La famille, he would want to be with Ankar. Dans ce But here in this story, the boy is alone only because parents were killed by the Vietnamese. Orphelin. Allegedly, the CPK's arch uh, nemesis. Être avec Ankar. We Alors, submit that if the party were trying to convey that the uh, eradication of the family were a good thing, uh, and the very last story that, would tell, nous, that they would tell is of a family destroyed by de the Vietnamese. De la famille, Mr. President, I'm mindful si of the time. I'm moving on to another document. De la Maybe une bonne chose, with your leave, this would be a good moment uh, to break. On ne raconterait pas que la famille ait été détruite par les Vietnamiens. The President. Thank you, Council. Yes, indeed, it is now an appropriate moment for adjournment. The Chamber will adjourn until 3 o'clock. Nous allons marquer une pause jusqu'à 15h. L'audience est suspendue.